You could really see a sense of pride on the faces of today's graduates ready to get back to work. Two of the graduates are mother and son. They tell me bettering themselves is better for the community. It is a great day in the city of Orangeburg. A day full of pomp and circumstance. <laughs> Lots of laughter. and even tears for the very first back to work graduating class in Orangeburg. The pilot program started in Columbia back in 2016. It's a five week boot camp where the individuals go through training as far as life skills. Um, we talk to them about resumes, we help them with interviewing, um, we also help them with basic computers. And it's not just for those experiencing homelessness, but any barrier to employment. It can be anywhere from having a criminal record to having um, lack of transportation, child care issues, and it can just be, I just don't know how to look for a job. At first I wasn't really interested in the program because I didn't see the value in it. He was persuaded to join the class by his mother, another one of today's graduates. Recently, um, our community has been suffering with uh, murders and things of that nature, so being able to come into a, a, a positive, you know, activity where it will strengthen the, not only me but the community as well. I felt like it was a, a wonderful opportunity. Take advantage. And there are three words I would like you to remember. In spite of, you can succeed in spite of where you live, where you come from. You are on your road to success. There was a total of four graduates taking part in today's ceremony, but one of them could not be here because it was his first day on a new job. In fact, three of the four graduates have already found employment. In Orangeburg, Emily Scarlett, WIS News 10.